Good afternoon and welcome to the JP Tennis Topics. This is John Phillips, Rackets Director at the Seagate Country Club, sharing with you my thoughts on tennis. This week we're focusing on creating a new event, how to create a new event, and just a couple of strategies that I use when it comes down to creating a new event. The first thing that I try to do is you have to have an idea. You have to have an idea that you want to implement. So maybe for, for starters, it's something like, I want to have the ability to have a mixer every week and that's my first step. Okay, so you know you want a mixer. Well, now make it a little bit more specific. Well, what kind of mixer do you want? Okay, I want a couples doubles mixer. I want to be able to have couples come on out, play a little tennis, have a little bite to eat. That's my theme. Okay, great. You created or you had an idea. Okay, well, now you have to be able to test out that idea. And there's two ways to test it out. First is verbally. It's you're going to have to be able to get a feel for what people want at your club. Instead of putting it on paper and saying, boom, it's all set to go. Next four, six months, we're going to have a couple doubles mixer every single Wednesday or whatever the case, or every single Friday, whatever that date might be. No, first, you test out the idea. You go to those members and you say, hey, looking to put this together. Do you think something like that might work? And then you offer a couple of times. And what generally will happen is someone will say either I'm interested or I'm not. Or they'll say I'm interested, but I just can't do that time, but I can do that time. Okay, so you start that conversation. So you're testing that idea. The second part of testing that idea is actually running the pilot program. This is not attached to a weekly schedule that's posted online. It's not attached to a weekly schedule that members get in an email. It's literally just a pilot program. You run it as a pilot. Okay, let's just do a couple of doubles mixer. It's a pilot. We're not gonna put it on paper yet. We wanna see how it goes. We wanna be able to be able to like, best part about pilots are you, know, you try it, you're like, okay, this was good. 80% was great, 20% wasn't. Before we actually go live with this and people actually see it and they can sign up and they can wait and they can anticipate for something like this, you're able to kind of clean it up a little bit so that on day one, when it actually shows up on that calendar, people come and people take pictures or whatever the case might be from the club, your general manager stops by. Whatever happens, you're ready to go. And that 20% that wasn't so clean, you kind of touched up a little bit, 100% running well. Okay, so you had an idea, you tested the idea. Okay, that's a huge part of creating a new event, okay? You are gonna test that idea how you're gonna be able to provide feedback, get feedback from members, what times work, what times don't. Um, you might also ultimately, the last thing I'm gonna say is get rid of the idea, right? So you have an idea, you test out the idea, and if it goes great, like I said, you clean it up, then you can post it. If it doesn't go great, you throw it away and you come up with a second one. I can't tell you how many times that's going to happen to you in the future when you're putting together a new event. There will be times where you're going to think there's something that's a great idea. And guess what? It's going to bomb because guess why? Members just don't think it's a good idea. Or maybe it worked at the club that you were at on the East Coast, but you went to the West Coast and all of a sudden it fell apart. There is, there's a whole lot of different reasons why your expectations might be here and it falls flat. Okay, it doesn't mean that you have bad ideas, it just means like that's just not the one that's gonna sit well with membership that you have. So you try it again, and you try it again, and you try it again. So again, this is kind of my formula when it comes down to creating a new event. First, you have to have an idea. Second, you have to be able to test that idea by listening to what members have to say and providing a pilot event uh, for what it is that you wanna do. And ultimately, third, you have to be okay with letting it go, scrapping it, if it doesn't go right and start over again and do it again, and do it again, and do it again. And eventually you're gonna hit, um, you're gonna strike gold. And you're gonna be able to do something very successful. But again, I think that's your best formula for success when it comes down to creating a new event at your, uh, at your country club. So I hope this was helpful. I look forward to being back with you uh, next week.